All right, I found a calibration section in the manual. So we need to get to the bottom. And so what we're gonna need to do is crack it in half again and then take the measurement section out and just hang on a second. All right. So we're gonna take the measurement section and we are going to attach it. Connector to connect, there's a big, big connector that goes between the two boards. And we will put that in here without putting fingerprints in the wrong spots. All right, so we're gonna to have to calibrate upside down. So put the power on. All right, let's lower you down. Okay. And we can turn the power on. There we go, zero volts. All right, calibration. It says, um, let's see, where do we start? Calibration procedure. Adjust, 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 adjust. Recommended test equipment. AC adjustments, DC adjustments, three adjustments. All right, select the 10 volt range. Uh oh, my power switch does not stay engaged all the time. That's the problem with this switch. I think I'm gonna maybe just glue it down. All right, it is not cooperating. Uh, we will remove this section. And I have an idea. Maybe I'll just remove the spring and cause it to be in all the time. Okay. It says hook up 10 volts uh, on the 10 volt input. Let's see here. High low, put in 10 volts. And we're measuring 9992 and it's 9999. So it's, we need to go, we need to change a little bit. I find an adjustment tool. There we go. And it says that we should be measuring 10 volt adjustment should be 10 volt adjustment. Let's see. It's like this. 10 volt adjustment is right here. All right, is that on camera? Sort of, all right. Uh, 10 volt adjustment, DC adjustment is here. Let's see if that does anything. Yes, it does. And it is 999. Uh, very easy to, very easy to adjust. So that's where we will leave it. Now it says, um, Hundred volt range. All right. There's a hundred volts, and we need to press the hundred volt button there. And the hundred volt adjust is this one, I think. Hundred volt DC adjust. All right. And we are at 99, 99, 99, 90, 99, 99, there we go. All right. And what is our thousand read? Thousand reads, okay. Where's the thousand button? Course scale, can we go higher on my machine over here? Yeah, 110 is as far as I can go. One nine nine nine. All right. So the thousand adjust, thousand course adjust, thousand 
thousand thousand volt DC adjust is here. We can move that up a little bit. There we go. Uh, looks good to me. All right. All right. Let's go back down to hundred volts. Nine 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 nine. Very nice. Go down. We're over ranging. Ten volts. Nine nine nine. Nine 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 nine. All right. So the ten volt range. We need to adjust a little farther. Okay. All right. Oops. Should be nine nine nine. Nine nine nine. All right. We'll leave it there. All right. So, what we need to do now is uh, resistors on the other side. So we will need to rearrange things to get. I'll get my resistors down. And ohms to ohms. And we will go to ohms. And one thousand. Okay, so probably everything's a bit too close. All right, so ohms adjust. We have a, uh, let's see here, calibration ohms. Adjust it for 10K. 10K is here. Here's 10K. The 10K adjustment is Okay, adjustment. 10k adjustment is this one way back here. Okay, oops, too far. A little finicky, but I'd say that's good enough. All right, so 10K adjustment and set the decade resistance to 10 mega ohms. I don't think this thing goes to 10 mega ohms. It'll go to, let's see, 10. 10 mega ohms. It goes to 1 mega ohm, and that's reading pretty good. All right, I don't have a 10 mega ohm. Uh, I guess I do. Let's see. I do. I do have a 10, 10 mega ohm. I have it. 10 mega ohm. Yeah, I've got a resistor right here that's 10 mega ohms. Interesting. Okay. So uh, let's. Uh, Let's use that. It's right here. And it's difficult to hold everything. That looks good to me. That looks good enough to me. It's definitely within the ballpark. Okay. 10 meg, and then everything else is an AC calibration, I believe, DC. 1 volt AC, 100 volts AC, 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 DC, DC, AC. All right. So we got our homage. Let's go to DC or AC volts. We'll go to 1 volt AC. And we will turn on some AC. It says the AC should, AC should be at 10 kilohertz. Okay, 10 
kilohertz. Amplitude, one volt. One volt peak to peak. And we can put that on the input, see what happens. And nothing is happening. Let me hook up a different meter here. Make sure we're getting one volt. AC. And we have, nope, that's not working. Oh, peak, I don't want peak to peak, I want RMS. Uh, amplitude, enter number one volt RMS which is that button there, one volt RMS, there we go. Let me measure this over here again. There we go, now we've got one volt RMS and we got it 0.9932, very nice. All right, so the one volt RMS, uh, we are on the one volt scale, one volt RMS adjust is, uh, one volt adjust is this one way in the back. That's interesting. Okay. Let's see if we can't adjust this. Yeah, we can. Uh, Yeah, I don't know if this is adjusting very well. ECCAL. Hmm. 0.996. I guess. I'll just keep turning it. There we go. 999. 999. One. Close enough. We'll call it one there. Okay, and then the next one is AC. AC adjust, we have, that was the one range. Here's the 10 range. And that one we adjust, that one we adjust, 10 volts AC adjust. The 10 volt AC adjust is right here. That one's, to, yeah, this one here. Let's see if this six, seven, go this way. Okay. And 100. I really don't have a good way to calibrate these high end stuff. Point, point eight one should be point should be one. So hundred volt adjust is is this thing. Let's adjust him. All right. AC. Blah, 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 blah. Well, I think I'm going to leave it there because I don't have a good way of calibrating that high stuff. So we will call it quits. We will give it back and say, seems to be working good except for that switch. And I need to block that switch so it won't press it any farther. But other than that, yeah. Uh, so yeah, let me work on that switch and button it up. All right, there we go. Um, I will give this back to the ladies for them to sell. Uh, everything works great on it except for the power switch, which is now hardwired on. Um, do not push the button. And uh, it can go to an engineering group because it says engineering right on it. Uh, this was from Foxborough. Notify accounting department if moved.
Uh oh, we better call him up. I don't even know who Foxborough is. Anyway, that was fun.